Hi everybody, I'm going to show you how to do Kimber's makeup and Kimber is Jim's sister. So I'm so sick of everyone just saying it's Jim's makeup but um, you also can do Kimber's the same way you do Jim's. So I'm going to show you an easy way to do this. This is, this is Everybody can do it. You don't have to have expensive makeup to do it. So the first thing I'm going to start off with is a lip liner, a pink lip liner. And this will help you if you can't draw perfect lines instead of having to paint makeup on perfectly go ahead and start off the base coming down making a line and it goes all the way up and it kind of comes down And the easiest way to do this, instead of coming around and making it perfect, just go from the middle of your eye and then just bring it back around. And there so far you've got your base, so you've got your line, and you'll be able to fill it in with the pink. Well, I've got just a regular brush you can get anywhere. This one happens to be from Avon. And this right here is um, Liquid Cream Blush. I got it from Merle Normans. It's called the Fruit Tart Blush Glazed Berry, and that's what I'm going to use to paint in this right here. So we're going to start with, just kind of dab a little bit on your brush, and then just start filling in. And I tried lip gloss, but I would not suggest it because it is so freaking sticky. And it was a pain in the butt to get off. so. This right here will kind of sit naturally. It will kind of go on like liquid at first. So it's easy to spread and smooth around to the way you like it. Unlike the lip gloss. I just try to even my out. That way I can just that way it won't be so noticeable of the line that I drew on there earlier. Now you can go over it a couple times, so it's not like it's gonna you go over it and it's gonna pull up what you've already put. It's kind of just a layer based makeup. And I just want to put a thin layer right here, just to kind of give it, so it's not exactly the same, it's a little bit lighter. Okay. So now that I've got this one done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to repeat the other side. And once I have that done, we'll finish the rest of this. Okay. Now that you've got both of your eyes filled in, we're going to move on to the next step because I don't like just doing one flat color. I want to kind of give it a dimensions. So this right here, I actually got from Dollar General, believe it or not. It's LA Colors Shimmering Loose Eyeshadow and it comes with a very cheap brush, but it's going to serve for our purpose. So I'm just going to tap a little excess because I don't want to use too much of it. 
and just go over just only the top lid tap it and just go over top lid there and like I said you this is a layer base so if you don't like the way it looks just put on another layer And I actually just want to do a little bit under the eye. Uh, just a little bit, not too much. Okay. Now that we've got that done. Next, what I want to do is just take a little bit of silver eyeshadow and this one happens to be from Maybelline just a gray suede and I'm going to take my brush and just go a little bit underneath your brow just to kind of give it a little bit of shine and I actually would like a little bit through here and in the corner of your eyes. Just do a little bit in the corner of your eyes and spread it out. And right under your brow. This way it kind of gives you a highlighted area instead of just being straight on bright red pink. And the next step, I've got me some kind of a bluish smoky liquid eyeliner. This one happens to be called Fog and it is also from Merle Normans. So I'm going to take this and I'm actually going to do on top of the eyelid and that way it kind of gives you a little bit defined. Make sure you let this dry before you completely close your eye up or else you're going to get the liquid eyeliner on top. If you're not used to using liquid eyeliner, you know this. You, well, you don't know this. And for those who do, you already know. And just bring it all the way down to the end of lashes, no, no curl or cat-like. And we are almost done here. And um, for the lips, just take your lip liner and go around. We have nice defined pink lips. And this right here is Crusade Rose Rose Champagne and this is from Avon lipstick. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it.
and then just like we did with the, the eyeshadow, I'm going to use the same LA Colors that I got from Dollar General, and I'm going to take it and take a little bit of the pink shadow and just kind of do the inside of my mouth right here. And see, it kind of gives it a gloss. It highlights that area and do it to the top lip too. And you only want to do it on the inside part of your lip. And see, now it gives it kind of a nice highlight. And now that my eyes are done, I'm going to put on some mascara. And then I'm going to put on some blush. Of course, you don't have to if you don't want to. I'm just going to tickle the top lid. And then I'm going to pull towards my eye. And I'm going to tickle the bottom of my lashes and do the same thing. There you go. And now I'm just going to repeat the other side and put on some blush and then I'm going to throw on the wig and show you the finished product. Okay, I'm back and as you can tell I am all Kimbered out and actually the wig I got from Walmart and it used to be called a devil she wig and what I did is I just cut out the horns and then just laid the flat uh, the hair right flat on top of where the horns used to be and then I had to do a little bit of brushing careful brushing to kind of get me some bangs here to go the right way because they first were down here and I didn't want to cut them because I like the length so I've got me my nice red wig <laughs> and uh, the actual coat I got from Goodwill for like six bucks but Kimber had on like a pink shirt and then a white blazer on top and then some like light blue jeans or pants and some high pink heels which unfortunately um, <laughs> I could not find pink heels but I went to Memphis and found me some so they are out there, ladies, let me tell you. And now you're all ready for Halloween in your Kimber outfit. And like I said, the makeup, you can actually do the same. is exactly for Jim as it is for Kimber. They're exactly the same. And yeah, so go have fun with your Kimber outfit. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any questions, you can always just write to me. And I will answer them. So... Truly, truly, truly outrageous. Whoa, jam. Music's contagious. Jam is my name. No one else is the same. Jam is my name.